So we're here at West Tech 2021 based in Long Beach and I have the privilege and the fun to be with my colleagues from the UK who flew all the way over. Paul's never even been to the US. So now we get to hang out at a trade show in the US in Long Beach. What are your thoughts so far? It's brilliant, Tony. It's great to be here, for one. Unfortunately, the sun's not come out yet, which is a bit of a disappointment. We landed here yesterday after a long slog, 11 hours on the plane, expecting to, you know, immediately put on the shorts and the T-shirts, but it just hasn't happened. So hopefully this afternoon, who knows? Well, I know you wanted to put on a bathing suit right away. We've been messaging for months about this entire trip. Muscle You're so Beach. <laughs> Muscle Beach, that's where I've got to go later. Yeah. Don't worry, guys. I'm going to take him to Muscle Beach in a little while when we come back down from some of our other journeys. So we'll get him there. So the trade show itself, we're seeing good traffic here, a lot of companies, maybe not quite as many machines as we would normally see, but we're seeing really great traffic and a lot of positive conversations. Would you agree? Yeah, I would. I think we've, we've actually seen, I think what's fascinating for me to come here from Europe is um, there's a lot of machines uh, and technologies here that we see around the world, yeah? The, the CAD CAM solutions, the tooling suppliers, machine tool companies like Star, Citizen, Fanuc, Nakamura, they're all here. Um, but we also spot some sort of gems here that I've never seen around Europe. Certainly we've just looked at a Fuji machine, a multitasking machine. Now I don't know Fuji for machine tools, but apparently this is something that in America they're, you know, they're quite prominent. So it's good to see the different mix and the different blend of stuff from around the world. And come in here, Obviously, you speak the Queen's English and I speak American English. Have you been welcomed by everyone? Have you been really enjoying talking with everybody about the technology? Uh, yeah, you have. You, it's, it's always a bit of trepidation with uh, trade shows because you don't quite know whether people are going to be welcoming to, to do this, to film. I mean, we've shot probably 10 to 15 videos this morning and everybody's been, you know, come on the stand and, and, and shoot our technologies. Sometimes you might go to places, uh, yeah, uh, around Europe and they might be a bit reticent to be, to be on camera, but it doesn't seem to to be like that here. They want to show off their technologies uh, and they do a good job of it. And so do you. Well done over the last few months. It's great to see you again. I did pay him to say that, you know, the extra 20 bucks in his pocket to give me that compliment. But we always appreciate all of you who watch. It's really great to have you and Mark and Joe and everyone here to be a part of this wonderful event. I've seen lots of hugs and warm welcomes. And you're right about sometimes we get a little bit nervous about jumping on camera, right? But You've already filmed over 10, 15 videos, and people are excited to see MTD, not just in the UK, not just in the US, but growing globally constantly, because this is where they get their news from on a global scale. Yeah, and I think what's really interesting here as well is the fact that we've, we've talked to the Matsura guys who, who um, actually collared us as we were walking down one of the aisles, but they're sold and distributed in this territory via Selway, I believe. So there's, it, it works very differently here to how it, how it does in Europe, but I suppose with such a big, big country, continent, you know, you, you need to have dis different distribution outlets. Um, so that might be a little bit confusing for us because, for, for example, in the UK, you know, Mazak, Matsura, DMG Mori, they are, they are sold, you know, by the principal in a sense. Um, whereas here, there just seems to be a lot more names around, which must be great for you because it's more opportunity. There's definitely a lot of opportunity with the U.S. being number two in the world in manufacturing, with the country being so big. And we've seen it take off like a rocket ship here this in 2021 in the U.S., haven't we? Yeah, you have. And I mean, the, the, it's great that the, the COVID thing is hopefully beyond us. But I think what's also very common around the world is everybody's obviously still, I know we're not wearing masks at the moment, but people are wearing masks, they're conforming to all the uh, the regulations. We have to show all the necessary passes to get in here. So these, these shows are being conducted safely around the world. I think what would be good to hear from you is, I mean, this is this is West Tech, but there's, there's lots of other techs, isn't there, around the US. How does that work for, let's say, the European or the UK audience that they don't know? That's a great question. So to answer that, that question specifically, we have here in the US dozens, dozens, if not even hundreds of trade shows, and they're broken down. Most of them are regionally. So we're at West Tech right now, meaning we're in the western part of the United States, and it's in Southern California. And in doing this, there's also an East Tech and a Houston Tech and a South Tech and a Fab Tech and all of these ones, right? But when we think, where's the international audience going to come? It's typically going to be the IMTS. Because the country is so big, Paul, and because we have so much going on with not everything being direct, the regional areas is why these shows are effective. If you think about, okay, I have a DMG machine, but I have 15 different companies that support me across the country, each show regionally is going to support that specific distributor in that region, which is why it's broken down that way. 
Uh, can't wait for the next couple of days. We're off to the Haas uh, outlet tomorrow, I believe, aren't we? And we're also going to the uh, a Mazak distributor to see machines. I believe we're doing a, seeing an engineer to do a case study one day. So I'm really enjoying it, Tony. Do you think people can tell that we didn't get to bed till two or three o'clock this morning? What do you guys think? Can you tell? Ha, 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 ha.